welcome to this lecture so in the lecture i talk about the nutri operator for uh, time translation now i will talk about the unitary operator for space translation so for that let us proceed as follows since uh, space translation is defined as in simple language or in layman language translation is defined as d upon dx form also we know from quantum mechanics that momentum operator can be written as iota h cross d upon dx so from here we can find out d upon dx is equal to px over iota h cross with negative sign so this suggests us that this generator for space translation can be expressed in momentum operator as momentum operator divided by h cross is proportional to d upon dx right so therefore we will define this generator as px over h cross so therefore unitary operator can be infinite simul unitary operator can be written in this form that means it is i plus iota epsilon g where g is px over h cross so that means it will become sorry it is px over h cross now we will discuss effect of on cat psi and psi is a function of x so therefore this u e g phi x it can be written as i plus i over h cross epsilon px into psi x so it is psi x plus i over h cross epsilon px psi x psi x plus iota over h cross epsilon and the value of this momentum operator which we have substituted here right so this h cross will cancel out with it and iota square will become minus 1 and minus minus will become plus 1 so therefore this psi this will become psi x plus epsilon d psi x over dx right so this can be written now in this form so therefore when this operator operates over psi there is a incremental change in the v function so how it can be interpreted the result can be interpreted as when the 
और UEPX acts on a wave function. It translates it spatially by an amount. equal to epsilon. Now, let us see the effect of on the position operator X. So when u x u dagger operates in this way over x, it will give us a new position operator. So that means or in terms of momentum operator they can be expressed in this way. I plus iota over H cross epsilon P X X I minus iota over H cross epsilon P X and this must be equal to x plus iota over h cross epsilon p x x right this we have uh, this i have written directly as we did all such type of mathematics in the earlier lectures also and uh, x plus iota over h cross epsilon. If I take minus from here, then it will become x p x. So that means that equal to x plus iota over h cross epsilon minus iota h cross it is the value of this commutator so this minus will become plus so that means this x sorry not with but this will cancel out with it x plus epsilon so this is the effect which we see on the position operator there is incremental change in the position operator right with the operation of unitary operator so with this this article will be finished so and thanks for watching this lecture